The McLaughlins are traced to Gilchrist, the grandson of Anradan or Henry, from whom all the clans of the Sheol Gilevri are said to be descended. They possessed the barony of Strathlochlan in Cowell, and other extensive possessions in the parishes of Glassery and Kilmartin, and on Loch or Side, which were separated from the main seat of the family by Loch Fine. They were one of those Gaelic tribes who adopted the Ord Galley for their special device, as indicative of their connection, either by residence or descent, with the Isles? An ancestor of the family, Lachlan Moore, who lived in the 13th century, is described in the Gaelic manuscript of 1450, as son of Patrick, son of Gilchrist, son of de Dillan, called the Clumsy, son of Anradan, from whom are descended also the clan Neil. By tradition the McLaughlins are said to have come from Ireland, their original stock being the O'Loughlins of Meath. According to the Irish genealogies, the clan Lachlan, the Lamonds, and the McEwans of Otter, were kindred tribes, being descended from brothers who were sons of the Dillan, and tradition relates that they took possession of the greater part of the district of Cowell, from toward Point to Stracker at the same time, the Lamonds being separated from the McEwans by the river of Kilfinnan, and the McEwans from the McLaughlins by the stream which separates the parishes of Kilfinnan and Strathlochlan. De Dillan, the common ancestor of these families, is stated in ancient Irish genealogies to have been the grandson of a few Atlaman, the head of the great family of O'Neills, kings of Ireland. About 1230, Gilchrist MacLachlan, who is mentioned in the manuscript of 1450 as chief of the family of MacLachlan at the time, is a witness to a charter of Kilfinnan granted by Lomanus, ancestor of the Lomonds. In 1292, Gileskel MacLachlan got a charter of his lands in Urgadia from Balliol. In a document preserved in the treasury of Her Majesty's Exchequer, entitled Les Petitions de Terry Demandis Eniscos, there is the following entry, Item Gilescop MacLachlan a Demandi la Baroni de Molbride Juven, Appel Strath, K. Fu Pre Contra la Foire de Roi. From this it appears that Gillespie MacLachlan was in possession of the lands still retained by the family, during the occupation of Scotland by Edward I in 1296. In 1314, Archibald MacLachlan in Urgadia, granted to the preaching friars of Glasgow forty shillings to be paid yearly out of his lands of Kilbride, he died before 1322, and was succeeded by his brother Patrick. The latter married a daughter of James, steward of Scotland, and had a son, Lachlan, who succeeded him. Lachlan's son, Donald, confirmed in 1456, the grant by his predecessor Archibald, to the preaching friars of Glasgow of forty shillings yearly out of the lands of Kilbride, with an additional annuity of six shillings and eightpence from his lands of Kilbride near Castellaclan. Lachlan, the fifteenth chief, dating from the time that written evidence can be adduced, was served heir to his father, 23rd of September 1719.